Hello and welcome to MB Tech. My name is Matthew Bingham and today I'm going to go over the updating the mesh uh, on your uh, 3D printer. Uh, this is going through actual OctoPrint um, with the plugin for the um, I guess it'd be bed visualizer if you will for that. Uh, you need to install that plugin. Um, all that is is basically in your settings. Uh, you go to your plugins, plugin manager, and then in your plugin manager um, you can see that there there is the uh, it's called the bed visualizer um, and you just need to install that and then once that's installed then you'll actually have uh, this location here that should, that will be underneath the uh, uh, I guess ellipses here and then there'll be one here in the, called bed visualizer once you have the bed visualizer set up uh, from there you're just going to hit update mesh now and then on your printer um, you will see it go through the different points now I've set mine up to do 25 points, so it'll actually do 5 points by 5 points, so it'll be like a 25 grid. Uh, so it'll be pretty granular uh, once it gets finished doing that. So I will uh, demonstrate doing that now, um, and we will uh, hit the Update Mesh button, and we'll see what it does on the uh, printer itself. And we can also watch it from the control as well. Okay, once it's finished, you can see that now here is the uh, information that it pulled from the uh, the bed itself. And you can see it in general, it's pretty level. Um, it's level enough for me anyways. I mean, some people might want to tweak that a little bit more. Um, but if we go into the different corners, we can see like this Z is at 1.24. Uh, this Z is at 1.227. So you're talking 1.227 to 1.2, so a point zero two difference uh this corner here uh, is 0 0.315 so it's a little bit high and then this is 1.34 so it's a little bit high as well but you can kind of see the different uh what i would expect for different uh, i guess issues with pop possibly uh adhesion but uh we we're looking good here i mean to me this is really close um i guess close enough for what for what my needs are um so i'm gonna go ahead and print it with what i got here but that's how to show you that real quick uh within octoprint uh, thanks a lot. Again, subscribe, like, and uh, I'll have some more videos up real soon uh, and hope to see you back. Thank you.